All right, ladies and gentlemen, how's it going today? It's your favorite Mexican raincoat here. I hope you're all doing well today. I'm not doing too bad myself. Dude, there's a Karen movie, okay? Uh, this title isn't clickbait. I'm sure you've seen it around the community, people talking about it. There's a Karen movie. I was actually made aware of this by Mr. D'Angelo Wallace. I'm sure a lot of you guys are subbed to him. But basically, this Karen movie is about a Karen, obviously, and she is very mad at the world, as normal Karens are, you know? No Karen enjoys their life, right? Okay, this movie's actually crazy. I'm I'm not gonna lie. So this is about a psycho Karen and not any ordinary psycho Karen. This Karen is a uh, racist. I guess the movie directors decided, hey, we're gonna accurately depict what a Karen is and we're gonna make a racist. And I'm not gonna lie, dude. I, I think this movie's a joke, dude. There's no way this can't be a joke. It is just too bad of a movie, at least from what I've watched so far in the trailer. But we're gonna be watching that today. I figured with all these Karen videos on my channel and with there being a release of the Karen movie, we gotta check out the trailer, okay? So yeah, Without further ado, let's take a look at this amazing five-star film. Yeah, this is completely off topic from the Karen video, dude. I didn't know that there was somebody who could have a first name as Coke, like the drink. Uh, that's pretty cool, man. I mean, I wish my name was Coke. Poncho's kind of boring. I don't even know why I'm talking about this. I guess this is a long way from East Point. Baby, you just gotta give it a chance. So that is, in fact, the antagonist of the movie right there. You just saw her, Miss Karen. There she is, ladies and gentlemen. This is the crazy Karen of the movie. I saw this one tweet about the movie, and it said, It's unbelievably cringe. It's like someone took every woke stereotype about race relations and put it into a blender without nuance or subtlety. And this is from BET, like a big-ass company, okay? Like a big company made this. Just kind of embarrassing, but y you'll, you'll start to get what I'm talking about later on in this trailer once you kind of watch a little bit more of it. Tell me about your new neighbors. They're black. Okay, all right. Oh, you could have chose a lot of other uh, traits about them that you found interesting. Not too sure why their race matters and why you made that face while you said it. So yeah, Karen's a racist in this, all right? <laughs> Dude, I'm not gonna lie, dude. She kind of fits the part, all right? She she looks like a Karen. She looks like she'd approach me while I'm working at my part-time job at McDonald's, complaining to me how I didn't put five patties in her McDouble, even though McDoubles only come with two. She fits the part, okay? She looks like she'd say that. She kind of has the Karen haircut going on, but not really, you know, designers. I think we need to fix that one up a bit. Maybe cut the size. Maybe give her a bowl cut. Do you mind keeping it down? If you don't comply, I'll tell the manager. Just for laughing? You're gonna tell the manager just for- just for the guy laughing? Yeah, I mean, so as I said earlier, the, she definitely does play the part. She, she looks exactly like a Karen. If you don't comply, I'll poop my pants. Somebody's taking home security serious. Hi! I am Karen Drexler. I'm your neighbor. You need to be taking your trash cans off the curb right when the trash is picked up. So, uh, they're using that, like, little scary piano soundtrack that, like, are- that's used in horror movies. Is this a horror movie, or is this an action movie? Like, <laughs> I can't really tell. If I'm assuming it's an action movie, but I don't know. I mean, you got scary music playing right now, that one key piano thing that D'Angelo Wallace mentioned. I'm just confused, I'll, I'll be honest. Don't know whether I should be scared, don't know whether I should be excited, don't know whether I should be horny. Is she nice? Yeah. She's nice. Wait a minute. We have a white entitled neighbor named Karen. Karen. I like how they're trying to make it seem like it's this, like, crazy, crazy movie, when in reality, it's probably going to be one of the most boring movies ever watched. But I'm still watching it, okay? I'm gonna still watch it for a video. They got me to watch it just because of how stupid it looks, okay? <laughs> maybe you guys, too. Let me know down in the comments if you're gonna be watching this, and uh, maybe we can set up a good old watch party or something. I don't know. Yeah, no, but if I ever have a lady named Karen moving next to me, dude, I, by that point, I'd just move out because I already kind of know what type of person that is. Oh, Poncho, but you're being super judgmental. No, her name is Karen. I'm out of there. With how many Karens I've watched, dude, it's it's just nothing good, okay? Nothing good comes from a Karen. If I have any Karens watching this, I'm sorry you have such a bad rep to your name, but it's there. Okay, enjoy yourself. There she is, slaving away in the kitchen. I've come across some very suspecting teenagers. Suspecting? Can you please hurry up? Okay, <laughs> all right, that part, very, very accurate, okay? They did a really good job with that. I, I would assume the scene is gonna be good, too. If it's not, <laughs> 
then whatever, I guess. But, dude, I can't even begin to count how many, like, encounters I've seen with a Karen where she's suspecting something of two random teenagers doing absolutely nothing other than, like, skating or something like that. It's pretty much a Karen's job to search out some people having fun and it's their duty to ruin it. And hey, it looks like she did exactly just that in the trailer. So kudos to, uh, actually, no, I'm not even going to give kudos to the people who made it because it's still a stupid movie. Please, it's, they're very aggressive, yep. I left my wallet with my ID at home. Leave us alone, we didn't do anything. How the heck did you end up moving to this neighborhood? Next thing you know, we have criminals. You take care of him and I will take care of her. Would you mind stepping out of the car? My office has uncovered some disturbing information on her. Okay, so I'm starting to kind of grasp or understand what this movie is all about. So this this couple moves to a nice neighborhood where this Karen lives, and pretty much she's a racist, so she keeps on picking on those guys, or the new couple that moved in. And pretty much, I guess they're now getting an investigation launched on her or something like that. I have no idea. I'm not really too sure. I haven't seen the movie, but based on context clues from the trailer, that one guy says that he has a lot of news that he digged up on the Karen lady saying I'm not exactly too sure what that is but I'm starting to kind of understand this. They don't deserve the harassment from the Karen, so it's probably just gonna be a movie about the battle of harassment, which, I don't know. I mean, I don't know if that's worth really a movie. Karens aren't really that big of a deal when it comes to day-to-day -day life. Everybody just kind of laughs at them. I don't think anybody really took them seriously ever. And this is just kind of cringe, I'm not gonna lie. And her brother. She doesn't like black people. We have a search warrant. Well, I'm black. I know, she doesn't like you either. I want to sell the house. What do I do? You can't tell me, huh? We are living next door to a racist. Okay, <laughs> okay, so maybe I was wrong about earlier. I guess this is a horror movie because she just flashed a gun. I guess the Karen is trying to now kill her neighbors. Wow, that took a turn. All right, so I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Didn't expect that. I don't think I've ever seen a Karen that is crazy enough to kill the person they are mad at. Not gonna lie, that, that's a first for me. You went in her house? You wouldn't want your wife to know our little secret, right? I was not staying in place procedure back there. What do we have here? We well, got a hammer. Everything looks like nails. You people are very angry. Shut your mouth, boy. <laughs> Bad things happen to people that don't comply. Yeah. Yeah, so that was, that was the entire movie trailer. Uh, gotta yawn twice now, god damn. Yeah, so I don't know. <laughs> I think it's pretty stupid. That That's all I'm gonna say. Ah, uh, Poncho, boring take, boring take, Poncho. Yeah, I, I really don't know what else to say about this movie. I seriously think it's just pointless and stupid. I, I There's really not much else to explain about it. I'd rather watch a movie about paint drying the canvas strike back. This low-key looks like something a bunch of college film students would make as a joke. Yeah, no, I'm definitely gonna back that one that is 100% facts. I don't know fellas, I'm still gonna watch it just because, just for the memes, okay? I'm, I'm still gonna watch that shit. So yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like and if you wanna see more content like this in the future, feel free to subscribe, I'm not here to force you though. Yeah fellas, with that being said, I hope you all have an amazing rest of your day. Make sure you guys are staying safe. Make sure you guys avoid this Karen movie because it's probably not worth your time and I'll be watching it myself so you can, you can uh, just watch my video on it, <laughs> okay? Alrighty fellas, I hope you all have a good one. I will catch you all tomorrow. Peace.